This is Linda Sherman, at Linda Sherman on Twitter, and I'm here with Stephanie Michaels, at Adventure Girl on Twitter. Thank you so much for being with us here today, Stephanie. Oh, thanks, Linda. I'm a big fan of yours, so it's an oh. honor to do this for you. Oh, wow, Stephanie, thank you so much. Stephanie, you are famous for many things. One of them is talking about building your brand online, you are your brand, and so forth. Could you talk about that, please? Wow. Well, um, to, to start, you have to be organic. So you have to find your passion. And once you find your passion, it's really easy to build your brand. Um, I always say, especially for Twitter, keep your brand name short, um, if that's possible to do. And, um, and then start tweeting about your passion. Start tweeting about your brand. And also listen. Listen to the people that are kind of responding and, and getting back to you and saying, like, put out a tweet. Hey, what do you guys want to hear from me? and let them tell you what they think your brand is. I mean, obviously you have a clear-cut vision of what your brand is going to be, but once you start using social media, that brand, um, you have to be willing to change it up a little bit and kind of navigate through those social media waters. And if someone doesn't want to hear you tweeting about Africa, well then, you know, someone doesn't want to hear you tweeting about Africa, it's time to move on to Iceland, let's say, for me, especially for my brand. I have to really listen to what my people want to hear from me. Um, and also stay current. You know, if there's topics, stay on point um, with those topics that are current of the day. Um, so, for example, for me, it's travel warnings. Um, I tweet about travel warnings. And I just think that once you become an expert in that field or you become known as an expert, um, that helps, in, you know, basically further um, engage your brand um, with social media and with the real world. Because there is a real world out there, you guys. <laughs> And that's my next suggestion is get out there, get to conferences, get people knowing who you are in person um, because your fans really want to meet you and your followers really want to know who you are offline as well as online. So um, those little things, I mean, you can't build your brand without people and without a story. So tell your story and meet the people that are behind your brand. Fantastic. Thank you so much, Stephanie.